Guys, you got plenty of room in there? Yeah. Yeah, it's gonna be nice. You're gonna be able to lay down and sleep the whole way? Yeah. yeah. All right, guys, let's do the before and after thing. Did we is put this, any? Is this before or after? <laughs> yeah, how do we do? Oh, we'll leave the viewer to decide. <laughs> hey, guys. Guys, let's see, emotional check. How are you, are you prepared for this journey? Yes. Yeah. Yes, yes. What about you, Tom? Yes, I am prepared for this journey. Lori, how are you feeling? What's what's the, how's I the vibes? Am, I forgot my cowboy hat. Oh, shoot. And the vibes are not good. Guys, let's see, emotional check. How are you, are you prepared for this journey? Yes. Yes, yes. What about you, Tom? Yes, I am prepared for this journey. Lori, how are you feeling? What's, what's the... Vibes. Ah, I forgot my cowboy hat! Oh, the vibes are not good. Alright, how are the vibes? Good. Alright, Raven. Yeah. Are you ready for this trip? How are you, how are you feeling? I'm feeling great. <laughs> ready to go. And, and back of the head, Beck? I'm excellent. Alright, alright. Good. We good. We, ready to go. we can leave now. Here we are at the Flinders Ranges and these are a few emus that we saw and they're just wild emus that we saw along the road. Okay, Eric, I'll stand for another picture. And here is no future because basically cracked in two. Oh, it's what? morning in camp, and we got some new neighbors. Yeah. Um, Laura, you gonna go talk to him? Hmm? You gonna go talk to him? We had a little problem. Dad, I think we took a wrong turn. We didn't care. We had our DS's. Alright, now it's time for a tour down under. <laughs> Did you are you, you recording now? Yep, yeah, I'm recording. Okay, wait, let's tell them where we are. We're at Cooper PD. We're at Cooper PD. Here's a good one. After a hard day, we needed some rest. While we stopped at Cooper PD, we stayed at an underground hotel. The view from the underground hotel was great. <laughs> Where, which one's who? This one looked like a boy and one looked like a girl? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> We're here at the Iwaninga rock carvings, right at sunset, and the lighting is just perfect for us to be able to look at these. Here we are at Stanley Chasm. Here's a picture Tom took looking straight up. Dad and I climbed up to the upper canyon. Here are some horses. Thanks, Thanks Anna. Anna. There's a dingo. Thanks, Dad. Here are some pictures from Kings Canyon. Here's a view of Katashua and here's annoying little sister and then here is the other side 
Stop, stop that. I hope you're not recording and flinging it around like that. You should be setting. Mm -hmm. You can do a camera like ours. Mama, Tom won't let me do anything, do anything. Finally, we made it to Uluru. We walked all the way around Uluru. This symbol means water hole or honey ant nest. This is a dingo that we saw on the rock carvings on. This is the Kentju Waterhole. It's one of the most beautiful places at Uluru. We got up really early to see the sunrise. All right, still waiting for sunrise. Still not there yet. <laughs> oh, there's a Tom monster. Here we are at Uluru and there's little markings on the rock that we thought we might change into something. So here's a butterfly. Um, that's what mom thinks is a toad, but I think it's a mole or a rhino. Um, there's some down there, but you can't see them very much. So, bye. The last hike. Bye bye, Uluru. Boom. We're headed back to Adelaide. Gonna be at Cooper PD tonight, and then back home tomorrow night. There's Beck and Raven driving in the Ute. We had a great time. Thank you, Beck, Raven, and Peck. Now what are you going to say? You know, you're not going to say that, okay? <laughs> For a picture, like say Uluru is monster or something like that. Or should I say that? Uluru is monster.